Good morning from Nebraska. If I was doing this right, I would have this camera up on a tripod. And it would be a bit steadier. Anyway, female pronghorn. And her baby's alongside in nursing. It's getting big. Of course, they have really, really long legs. But, uh... It's growing, growing, growing. It was born in May. They're standing in a ripening field of winter wheat. It'll be ready to uh, harvest before too much longer. A couple more weeks at most. If you look at the markings on that female, she doesn't have the black uh, markings at the base of her jaw. And I don't know if you can tell or not, but she does have horns, but they're pretty small and petite compared to a male's. And also, if you look closely, from time to time there's uh, cowbirds perching on her, and there's the little baby <laughs> getting bigger. So yeah, welcome to my world. All the crazy stuff in Peopleville. And we got this going on here. Wish I could hold my hands steadier. <laughs> Sorry about that. They're very alert, as pronghorn always are. And they're just a dot over there. <laughs> they're about halfway across this wheat field. Well, probably less than that because this wheat field has been combined and now it's a great big giant wheat field. Road going south. And the road going north, back around the airport runway. And mill it on that side. And red in here. And we'll take another look at these guys. This is a pretty good camera for no more than it costs me and the way I abuse it by just carrying it around in the pickup all the time. Like it's a tool or something. But my hands just aren't steady enough this morning. I don't know why. There's something profound, I think, and I don't, I can't describe it very well, I guess, but, uh, in the fact that nature's doing all of this nature stuff, and, uh, most of the crazy first world human beings are completely ignoring that, and completely live inside that fantasy bubble generated by the TV and the interwebs and the government media and are just completely bug stomp, crazy, psychotic, so far as uh, reality goes. If you, if you agree to the proposition that a psychosis is a view of reality that does not match up to the reality of reality, then yeah, that is bug stomp, crazy psychosis. And those people are frightening because they just get together and make up shit. Like we need to uh, tear down all these statues. We need to kill all these people who somebody's told us are our enemies. It's, yeah. But at least in the meanwhile, um, 
reality is real and it's out here even where you live reality is real okay that's enough